The following samples demonstrate some of VJet's capabilities to translate Java to JavaScript. Our goal was to make JavaScript syntactically, structurally, and semantically equivalent to Java. Let's see how we did. Starting with syntax, we made an effort to map each statement from Java to JavaScript as closely as possible. On the right, we'll translate an equivalent JavaScript class. Before going into structure, let's take a look at the iteration method. You can see control structures and statements map almost directly. Those things that we don't have syntactic equivalent for, we translate to a semantic JavaScript equivalent. The for each statement in Java is an example of something that doesn't have a syntactic equivalent. You can see in the example, each iteration creates a local val variable which system out is passed. Let's see some more examples and examine the structure of the translated JavaScript. Structurally, we sectioned out logical parts of a Java class and extended JavaScript to describe these parts. The goal was to make our JavaScript more familiar to Java developers as well as provide a good foundation to translate and build upon. In the conference VJet booth example, .c type defines the type given its fully qualified name. .needs defines the dependencies and ensures that the type will initialize only when the dependencies are loaded. The .proto section defines all instance members. Constructs is a special method in protos as it defines the constructor. And ntype completes the definition. Let's look at some other Java constructs we support. Enums translate to etypes. Interfaces translate to itypes. Implementing a class is equivalent to dot satisfies. In inheritance, extends is equivalent to inherits base is the same as super. The last part of the equation is semantic equivalence. We wanted things like strong typing and access control to provide true semantic equivalence without bloating the runtime or making it unreadable to Java developers. To solve this, we created annotations or ActiveJS comments. An angle bracket directly after an open comment denotes an annotation. Less than applies to the previous statement. Greater than applies to the next statement. Take a look at the get staff scheduled for method in the proto section. The method takes in one parameter day and returns an array list of eBay staff. Hopefully these samples has given you a glimpse of what VJet Java to JavaScript is capable of.